アイドル魔法少女チルチルミチルあーブブブブブブブブブブブブブブブブブブブブブブブブブブブブブブブブブブブブブブブブブブブブブブブブブブブブブ How's it going, everybody? We'll be here playing Idol Magical Girl Chiru Chiru Michiru Part 1. I have to wonder if that. I, I, I'd like to see the meeting where they were like, you know what? We need a name that accurately describes this game. She's an idol. But she's also magical. And she's a girl. So maybe we should call it. Idol lady. No, how about magical girl? What about idol magical girl? Chiru chiru m i c h i r u Why not have that bit at the end? I don't know. Apparently, this is something to do with another game called something else. I don't know. I've never played it and I'm just trying to. I just saw the name and it made me laugh. And I saw this cover and you can kind of see a butthole. A little bit, little butt cheeks. Not hole, cheeks. And then you see a cat. This looks just stupid, stupid. Looks dumb, but it looks fun. Hajime kara! Yeah. I am a true Ichiro, 14 year old, I'm a second year high student in bloom of youth! In bloom, in the bloom of youth? <laughs> I am not smoothie, Ichiro! I'm a second year high student in the bloom of youth! I'm in the bloom of youth. Youth m o o n l o s t is blooming from me. Amazing. Actually, it's a bit embarrassing, but. I'm an explosively popular national famous top idol! Oh my god, look, she looks so happy. Thank you so much, I love you all! <laughs> This is gonna get everyone to know. Thank you, thank you! Haha, <laughs> thank you! Wow, she just thank you a lot. She really likes to thank people. What is going on? We'll be holding product sales after the show, so everyone, please stop by. You can take pictures of us for a small fee or buy exclusive original guys or original s a l e small fee. <laughs> We want to spend lots of time with you, so come and spend lots of money, K. a y Oh my god, you two, you have the greatest, you'll totally be there. Thank you so much, okay? <laughs> Why'd she say okay so much? Our next performance is next week, same as today, here at the Lifehouse 9029. We'll be doing Idol Book Hub Volume 56. That's a. Hmm. We'll have lots of idols performing for you, so we're counting on your support! And what a deal! You can save 60 Ys on your ticket. I mean, it's yen, right? <laughs> 60 Ys! Don't spend those X's, though, when you purchase in advance, so by all means, please come and buy one! Oh my god, yeah, I really have one, but I'll buy another, take all my money, I love you, me, chiru, 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 me, chiru, idol, magical girl, chiru. Thank you very much! o k e m a t s u This concludes our performance for today. As the venue will soon be closing, we appreciate everyone's cooperation in smoothly exiting the building. Also, keep public order in mind. We must insist that you do not light her in front of the shop. You'll be shot. Those who do may be subject to an unbelievably strict punishment. Spanking. Oh my god, Yahoo! Punishment is the greatest. Please punish me. Oh, I wonder what she'll do to me. What the heck is. What is this dude? What? Oh my god, this is like. Weebo, Weebo Master. The well, gentleman currently making the spectacle of himself, a tax increase should do nicely. Oh, it's not quite what I had in mind. It's a tough world we live in. I was hoping for a spanky wanky. <laughs> it's the Jazz Bar, 9029. In the heart of the metropolitan area, on the weekends, its stage is lent out to host idle events. 
mainly a midnight bar, but it has gained some recognition as a starting point for rookie idols. A few such idols, having just appeared on stage, are now getting ready to leave. And at that moment, our heroine, M Mats Matsushimi Michiru, <laughs> has stepped off stage to catch her breath. Hi! Uh, what did I give it? Oh my god, Mitsu Matsama. Good work out there. Here, have a sports drink. Oh my god, thanks, Mugula. It's kind of soil out. What? <laughs> thanks, Mugula. I go fuck out and go over here. Wow, what? Ah. Uh, oh my god. What's happened to her eyes? There's tissues coming out of her eyes. It's a nightmare. She's got like squid tentacles coming out of her eyes. Is she a squid kid? Oh god, I thought I was pretending you were a sports drink, but I accidentally handed you a sports piece! Completely by mistake! What an uncanny resemblance! <laughs> oh my god, remember resemblance that way both look like nothing similar, they're totally different things! Despite that, we have now blessed with the opportunity of appreciating your fighting spirit as you down the sports pace without a moment's hesitation. Like the first place? <laughs> Ta-da! In the first place, what the hell is a sports paste anyway? My god, what the hell is a sports paste? I don't even care. <laughs> no, now, it's merely a sports drink made out of acorn paste. By all means, please gulp some more down. Why are you drink? What is going on here? Why is she so adamant on giving this girl sports paste? Thanks again! Look, I it's awful! It tastes like a lump of wheat! I don't understand what's happening. Why is she forcing sports paste down here? And why is she accepting it? I should think so. More importantly, you were brilliant today! The way you kept mentioning money with that hungry expression! I, Komini Sachi, was most impressed! I'm so glad that you uh, kept just saying how much you needed money. My God, I like, had no choice, you know. I, the chief told me to make sure to promote our sales as much as possible. Also, the way you flaunted your panties while pretending that you didn't want anyone to see them, I've never seen such an adeptly performed panty shot until today. What? Oh, I'm sick, Sachi. Oh my God, what? What did you just say? Oh my God, what? Like I said, the way you completely flashed your panties and so far, I, lo I loved it, man. I just like... Wow, that is a really good pair of panties. Really impressed that so you can, you know, show them off and nobody cares. Oh my god, like, you could see them? I thought you couldn't be able to from where I was dancing, though. Oh my god. <laughs> oh, my god. Oh my This is Anna. Did I stop as a horse? A horse? Yes, they were quite visible, your green striped shimmer pan. Shim your green striped sh shimmer pan. Shimmer pan. I don't know what that is. Them as a horse. Them as a fox. Blue tack. Oh my god, really? That was so careful of me. Oh my god. Also, did you just lay a diss of, on all the horse kind from out of nowhere? Why? Uh of course not. You're just imagining things. I didn't say horse. You're just crazy. But anyway, my panties. The customers didn't see them, right? Only you while you were behind the stage, right? Well... I may have taken a picture and put it on the screen. Oh, hey, me too. Today was the greatest. You were totally beautiful. I love you. Uh, th thank you. That choreography was really cute. I think I accidentally fell in love with you. Not as an idol, but as a normal girl, you know? <laughs> it made me think, if only you were an idol, I would have one of me and fall in love in some other world. I would totally want to convey my feelings to you, you, yo. Uh, that's all fine and good, but during today's show, like, uh, did you happen to see something? Huh? Something? What do you mean, something? I mean, I totally didn't see your panties and then go and toss on off in the toilet. I mean, I really can't really go into details, but, uh, 
I just fought by any chance if you happen to see something. It'd be nice if you told me, you know, because I've got like horseshoes coming out of my brain. Why? I don't know, but I do. Why has she got horseshoes coming out of her brain? Oh, uh, uh, yeah, okay, I don't think you got anything to worry about, bro. Everything's fine, me, Drew. Nothing to worry about at all. Oh, no, no, no. I definitely didn't see your panties, okay? Ah, uh, okay. Huh. Other than your panties, nobody saw a thing, right? Yeah. Yeah, you started seeing them. Oh my god, it's like totally gross because you're like a gross, geeky, weebo nerd and I don't even care. And I'm like, oh, my eyes are now lines and they are leaking and my mouth is a triangle. And now my eyes are empty and soulless like the panties that I wear. Ah. Oh my god, yo. <laughs> Who's this girl? Yo, buddy customer, our performance for the day are over. You must cordially insist that you promptly about faith and march right out of here, mister, okay? Oh, Asko, sorry, it's not like I was trying to do anything strange like cop a feel. Ah! Oh my god, the exit is that way, sir. Five, four, three. Okay, oh my god, okay, I made you, I gotta check some other places, let's meet again at your next show, I love you. Yeah, yeah, whatever, we hope to see you again soon. I don't have very many female voices, I'm sorry. He's finally gone. No, oh, uh, yeah, so we gotta, why you got you so clearly shaken up? Oh. <clears throat> I keep doing the same voice for her and the fan. My god, you got like the dead eye stare of a new recruit who dived into a trench to escape the three point burst rifle fire, only to panic when a grenade comes flying in. Ah, that's it. This is all a dream, just a bad dream. Of course, then you might end up with an expression like one of those guys who's completely divorced from reality when an explosion blows him into smithereens. What is happening right now? Oh my god, like what kind of expression is that? I don't even know. Those guys always have the same expression anyway. It's like, so just a normal expression, I guess. I don't know. I don't know, I don't really care, I don't like them. I like you though, you're really hot. Wow. <laughs> uh, that ice there is fine. Echo son, it seems like Beecher was depressed about showing her panty during tonight's show. Just look at her pitifully horse-like face. Why does he keep calling her a horse? Oh my god, her panties? Wearing such a short skirt, bouncing and twirling past the audience on such a tall stage, it'd be weirder if you couldn't see them, like... Oh my god, what? What? In fact, you 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 sure weren't you sure you weren't showing them off on purpose? Like I thought you were going for one of those perverts who gets off on that kind of thing. My God, I'm not like a pervert or anything. I'm like, ah, oh, no. Although I guess I do wear mis missy pants sometimes. I don't want missy panties. I'm just weird. I'm just assuming that's a, a cooking pan. Missy pan shirt for Mrs. Panda, right? What's going on? <laughs> Oh my god, are there like some pandas around here? Stop doing that. Wrong! It means okay if you see them, panties. Okay if you see them, panties? Is that a thing? Oh my god, okay if you see them, panties. Oh my god, like, kinda like, okay if they die, soldiers? <laughs> Why is she referred to everything as a soldier? What the fuck is going on? Oh my god, not quite, but like, probably something like that. Oh, yeah. oh my god, but Mr. there's no such thing as a soldier who's okay with dying. Wait, hold on, why do we talk about soldiers now? Well, anyway, I forgot my Missy Pan on stage today, so I had on my Magic Pan instead. Magic Pan, short for Magic Using Panda, right? Magic Using Panda? Are these all like super anime terms, or these? Just, I don't understand anything. This I'm culture shocked right now. Help! Oh my God, wait, they're really awesome. Some of those cute little black and white guys around here. Of course they are. Anyway, there's no such thing as magic using panders in the first place, right? 
Wait, is there? <laughs> you never know. <laughs> the world is vast after all. La, I want to see one. Oh, I'm not wearing no magic panner. In other words, they are serious panties. Normal wear on everyday ones. Why? What is happening right now? Why is there a conversation about pants going on? Well, whatever. I'm sure the audience will enjoy them. So, no worries. Alright, it's time for cleaning. If you could move out of the way, I'm sure everybody loved watching your panties, you little pervert. My god, come on now, Mishu Town. It's cleaning time and we're in the way. Come on, come on, out of the way, damn it. Damn it! <laughs> wow, but it was so embarrassing. <laughs> Why? What do you expect? Look how short your skirt is. It's like barely a skirt. I'm not surprised everybody saw it. Oh my god, like, even if there's no customers, I don't like having such a sad looking face around the shop. Why don't you, like, go and get outside and, like, you know, show your panties off or whatever? I don't care. Oh, I'll take up, I'll take up on that and get out of here as soon as possible. Good work tonight. My god, good work. See you, girls. Everyone, good work tonight. Good work tonight. Everyone's just saying good work. Shut stop. Idle and magical and girl. Oh my god, they saw my magic pan, huh? Oh, I'll have to think of a counter measure for next time. Even so, I still want to see one of those magic using panders. I wonder if they even come to Una Glue. Thinking she couldn't stay depressed forever, Mitru cleared her throat and started to proclaim her situation to the night sky. Indeed, in order to truly know oneself, it's sometimes necessary to perform this sort of self-validation. This is no good. I gotta cheer up. Ah. I am a two, 14 year old. I'm a second year junior high student in the bloom of you. Oh yeah, of course she was 14. That made that whole conversation way more perverse and freaky. Why would a 14 year old be showing off panties? That's creepy. What's that dude? That dude looked way older than her. <laughs> I'm a hurry and a bloom of youth. What is what is that? I don't understand that term. And actually, it's a bit embarrassing, but I'm an explosively popular national famous top idol. <laughs> but that was a lie. But that's a lie. I'm still a total newbie, and I'm not popular at all. It's not like I've ever released a CD or appeared on TV or anything. Oh my god, I'm such a failure. <laughs> I don't think me could only gather up in dingy basements and do live performances week after week, and we barely have any original songs. We'll just sing all of our karaoke tracks. And we only have around 10 audience members at the most, and most of them are like creepy little weebo virgins who just want to sniff my panties and, you know, fill me up. It's really creepy. I don't like it. I even call myself an idol just singing karaoke in front of people like that. And I bet I could find a more lively crowd than a company picnic. Hey, pretty little thing, could you pour me some more sake or something? I don't know. What? After show, they have to sell goods to the customers, take pictures of them, shake their hands, talk to them. Ugh. And that takes away longer than the actual shows. Wait, what are you? What? What is going on here? I don't understand what's happening in this. In this. I'm afraid I'll end up living this way forever. Let me show you how to dream. Ah, but I have a dream. Someday I'll become a respectable idol. And I'll spread the courage around and hope to everyone or I don't know, whatever. With the weight of reality bearing down on her, Michiru forced herself to continue. In the past, it's what I always wanted. That doesn't look like you. Again, what is this tiny, barely skirt skirts? As if in response to these words, a glimmering bead of light sp sparked in the night sky. As it caught the edge of her vision, Michiru looked up in surprise. Oh my god, a shooting star! Um, I wish to become a top idol! I wish to become a top idol! I wish to become a Weebo fan! The transient shooting star had already disappeared. Even the sky had turned its back on Michiru, offering nothing more than a cold, silent view. Oh my god, I am uh, no! Couldn't say three times in a row. How could you? When I'm in last for a second, who described you? Have to say it three times anyway. Why don't you be penalty? I mean, why don't you be plenty? <laughs> Such words of complaint spilling from her lips. 
Michiru looked overhead as miraculously another shooting star appeared. Oh my god, could it be? Um, oh my god, another one! Oh, what the heck? This game is so weird, I don't understand anything. <laughs>